Greetings and welcome to the introduction to astronomy. One of the things that I like to do in each of my introductory astronomy classes is to begin the class with the astronomy picture of the day from the NASA website that is apod.nasa.gov apod. And today's picture for September the 15th of 2020, well, it is titled, titled a biomarker phosphine discovered in the atmosphere of Venus. So what do we see here? Well, the image shown is that of the planet Venus. Now Venus is the closest planet to the Earth, at least when it's at their closest distances. And it is the planet most similar to the Earth in terms of mass and diameter. However, it is not generally thought of one where you'd look for life as we suggest looking for life on Mars. Venus, that's because Venus has very high temperatures, very high atmospheric pressures, and very harsh conditions on the surface. So we still don't think that life is very likely on the surface of Venus, in fact, be much more likely on the surface of other objects in the solar system. However, it is possible that in the atmosphere of Venus that there is, there could be some kind of life. Now that's still never been the highest priority to search for. However, a recent discovery uh, just announced just announced yesterday of finding phosphine in the atmosphere of Venus. Now why is phosphine so important for life? Well, it is uh, what we call a biomarker, meaning that it is not the type of of compound that generally forms from ordinary chemical processes. So certain uh, certain chemicals can form routinely when um, it just in general with on, on a planet's surface, we'll find various different chemical compounds. However, certain ones like phosphine are only found that we know of at least when there is life involved and are produced by microbes here on Earth. So it will be very interesting to see uh, how this holds up as it was recently announced the discovery. Now this doesn't mean that there is life in the atmosphere of Venus just suggestive of the possibility. We will of course have to confirm the discovery of this and then to find out if it was formed by biological processes meaning that there is some kind of life there or if it was formed by some other natural process. And that is something that astronomers will study over the coming weeks, months, and years. But it is still a very exciting finding uh, of the possibility of there being life on the Earth's closest neighbor. So that was our picture of the day for September the 15th of 2020. It was titled Biomarker Phosphine Discovered in the Atmosphere of Venus. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture, previewed to be asteroid ejection. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day everyone, and I will see you in class.